Romans chapter 8 verse 2 says, For the law of the spirit of life has set you free from the law of sin and death. What Paul is trying to say in context to Romans chapter 8 is that there is no condemnation for you because you are in Christ Jesus. And the reason why you are not condemned is because of this, that the law of the spirit of life has completely set you free from the law of sin and death. What is the law of sin and death? The law of sin and death is the system that we were in, which was governed by sin and death. Now we no longer are in a system that is governed by sin and death. We are in a system that is governed by the spirit that gives life. So the good news is that if you are in Christ, you are in a superior law, which is the law of the spirit that gives life. And that law has overridden the law of sin and death. The law of sin and death has no control over you. You are not living in that system that is governed by sin and death. You're living in a system that is governed by the spirit that gives life. Paul says something similar in Colossians 1. He says that we have been redeemed, we have been delivered from the kingdom of darkness and have been taken to the kingdom of light. We are no longer living in the kingdom of darkness. And this is completely by grace. God's unmerited favor towards us. Not because of something that we have done. It is because of who He is and because He chose to love us. What is our responsibility to what God has done? Believe. Just believe. Believe that you are no longer in the kingdom of darkness, but you are in the kingdom of light. Believe that you are no longer in the law of sin and death, but you are in the law of the spirit that gives life.